hello guys welcome back to my channel my name is mbo and as always i'm very happy to have you guys here if you're new to this channel please subscribe and join the family if you're a new subscriber i'm very happy to have you here thank you for joining the family today is a sunday <laughs> and obviously it's self-care sunday with mbo um i was just doing my self-care routine just for my skincare and i thought let me just um record it now in real time and just edit it and have it on by tonight for today self-care session so my lips are really dry right now. i've just washed my face because i didn't want to have to use my sink and like wash then come back because it's just discombobulated and there's not much lighting there today the sun is really sulky like it's not happy she's sulking so if my lighting is a bit low and shifty that's because my girl is sulking <laughs> so it's really cloudy um just a disclaimer i don't normally wear my wig when i'm doing self care but my hair i've been treating my natural hair i'm just trying out different treatment and it dries out my hair a lot so i always keep my hair covered i did some cornrows my friend did them for me so i don't want them out in the open so if i'm not in a bonnet i am in my wig or i have something tied over my head but my bonnet is currently not available so i just decided to let me wear my wig because i recently made this wig as well i made it sometime last week and i'm just so obsessed with it like it's really beautiful so that's also another reason i'm kind of like obsessed with this wig right now so i have washed my face showered obviously and now i'm just going to show you guys what i do after washing my face i'm going to show you the products i use to wash my face just so we're on the same page so i use this aqueous cream soap I don't know if you guys can see that. This is the first one that I washed my face with. 60 seconds. Scrub, scrub, scrub. Rinse. And then after that, I used this Neutrogena Hydro Boost um, Cleanser. 60 seconds. Washed it off. And then lastly, I washed with I washed with this Eucerin Demo Purifier Oil Control Scrub. So it says it unclogs pores, refines skin texture um it's only sunday that i use all three of them most of the time i just use one normally the aqueous cream soap and then at night i use the neutrogena but then on days that i wear makeup i use both at night after i'm doing my makeup and then with the userine i use it every other day after my initial cleanse so um now that i'm done with the washing i'm gonna just um mask my face i use this mask here from avon it's the blemish clearing jelly mask i mainly bought it because i have blemishes here and on this side if you guys can see so i just apply this normally <laughs> i apply it on a damp face but it's been a couple of minutes since i washed my face probably more than a couple because after i washed i you know moisturize my body all of that <laughs> so so because because i don't have blemishes all over i don't really put this all over my face um even my chin i don't normally put it there but my chin has been feeling very grainy lately so i'm just gonna put it there hopefully it can help even though it's whole blemishes i'm just hoping that it can help with something um I normally okay so this um, I, I'm supposed to wear this for 15 minutes I don't really time myself I just normally know when it's ready to take off so on Sundays what I do is I steam my face I used to steam twice a week but and for longer like sometimes I'll be sitting here doing my stuff and I'll steam for 30 minutes but once when i did that i once burnt my chin it wasn't a bad burn but it was like a steam burn and i used to feel it when i was washing my face and my chin was irritable and it went a bit darker you know we showed that it had it, oh my gosh sorry we showed that it was like too much of the steaming so now i steam for a minute so i use this safeway steamer i actually got this as a birthday gift from my friends um i just put water in there i'm a bit paranoid so i put like drinking water in there because i don't want bacteria in this thing 
so i put water you turn it on for three minutes and after three minutes it's supposed to start producing steam so i'm just gonna steam for a minute you know and then i'm gonna wait for this mask to sit in 15 minutes so whilst i steam and i wait for my mask to sit i'm just going to do my bible plan and yeah i'll be back with you guys once i'm done with that i'm just gonna wash this wipe this mask off and then we can continue <laughs> Okay, so I'm back. I just wiped. I just wiped the. Um, I just wiped the mask off my face now, and just patted it dry. So now I'm gonna take one of these cotton pads, and then I'm gonna take my rose water. Um, it's right here. I'm gonna take my rose water. It smells really lovely, <laughs> and then I'm gonna use it as a toner just to reset my pH. I think that's what they say. Or oh, reset the, yeah, reset your pH balance for your face. I don't know if that's actually like true. I've never like done any research on it, but um, I just, no, I just tone. So I'm, I think you can use any rose water. I got this from, in Gramsad, I got this from Mustard Seed, which is like a shop that sells like healthy stuff like healthy living stuff so i trust them and this one has a bit of alcohol but i think if you want to get like the best aim for the wine that does not have alcohol because if you have dry skin alcohol is very alcohol is very dehydrating it's very drying so you can dry your skin i have very normal skin I definitely am one of God's favorites, so I can use it and it's fine. After that, I'm going to take this Neutrogena Hydro Boost Serum. It's almost done, and I don't think I'm going to get another one because this is for people who have dry skin. Like, it's been good to my skin and all of that, but I do not have dry skin. So, in my opinion, I'm just wasting my money because it's for people who need extra moisture, you know. So, but it works really well, like, for my skin as well. So I just apply that all over. Um, it lasts quite some time. I think it la lasted, it's lasted me like three months now. And I use it every other day at night because I only properly wash my face at night. In the morning, sometimes I just use aqueous cream because it's very mild. And then after using aqueous cream, I apply my lotion and my sunscreen and that's it because when i wash like when i do a routine in the evening and i sleep like those oils are still on my face so washing them in the morning and doing a, like a thorough washing routine in the morning is kind of removing those essential oils from my skin so i leave i leave it like that sometimes even when i really see that my oils look really good my face is looking good i just use a baby wipe i wipe lotion and sunscreen on top so then now i'm done with the neutrogena i take this radiance maximizing tonic it's vitamin c and glycolic acid i don't know why i'm shaking it but i'm just used to shaking any liquid product i'm just used to shaking any liquid products before i use them so i use this after my serum because it's thicker like it's a treatment but it's got a thicker consistency than my hydro boost so i wear this after the hydro boost and like i said this is only my sunday routine my sunday skincare routine i don't always use these things together during the week 
um during the week when i wash my face on one day i can use this treatment plus the vitamin c and then i apply lotion i don't normally use neutrogena vitamin c and this treatment or i use the neutrogena and the treatment and then it's lotion so i use them interchangeably one because i don't need to be putting all these products on my face every single day and secondly <laughs> i don't have a job that's what i'm saying this is my vitamin c um serum from a new avon so i'm just gonna apply this is that enough i think it is i'm not gonna lie with vitamin c products in general i do not like citrus smells at all so yeah like they make my face look really radiant i'm not gonna lie like we're away my vitamin c my face looks bright and all of that but i just really hate the price i have to pay for it and that's the citrus smell and i can't work around it even if i get another product that is like um another different brand it's still going to smell like citrus because it is vitamin c and oranges and this one they say they put 30 oranges in this one serum you know so it's going to smell citrusy either way so i can't work around it. i just have to like swallow it but i don't really like it, especially at night Ugh. i use it because i have to but um i rejoice on the days that i don't have to so now i'm done with all of my serums pat them into the skin honey I saw Auntie Jackie said you should not be like dragging your skin downwards. Just like kind of like pat it in, you know. There's no need to increase your aging. Like just pat it in. So yeah, that's what I do. That's what I do. And it's so sticky. That's one thing I hate about this item. You see, it's really sticky. There are other brands I think that are not as sticky. So I will try them when this finishes. But for this one, the stickiness, mm. I'm taking this aqueous cream, this baby aqueous cream. When you watch my vlog, you see, I recently just got this. I was using the Neutrogena um, Hydro Boost cream, but it's very sticky as well. And paired with this vitamin C, I was not liking it. And I don't have like skin that's dry and that needs to be hydrated. So after it finished, I was like, okay, it's been good. Then I got this baby aqueous cream because it's very lightweight, it's not sticky, and it works well with my skin, very mild. It's also fragrance-free. Um, and I'm just hoping that it can cover the smell of this. I've only used it since yesterday, but I've never used it with vitamin C, so I'm hoping that it won't stink. Like, it won't smell. Like, I won't be able to smell the vitamin C. Which is kind of unlikely because this is... Um, fragrance fee so the vitamin c smell is very overpowering i'm not gonna lie i'm not gonna lie so yeah you can see that the skin is moisturized honey moisturized happy skin hydrated and i've seen people say you cannot drinking water does not give you clear skin and everything um to be honest i don't know if it actually gives you clear skin but i do believe that drinking water does hydrate your skin which in turn if your skin is hydrated it looks better and i also think that not drinking certain things does help your skin so watching what you drink if you know kuti like you're not a sugar person and all of that like sugar makes you break out and stuff the juices are not your friend either um but water is everyone's friend as far as drinking things and whatever so if you drink water, I do believe it hydrates your face. So, because I have to go to the DH today. What's the time now? I have to go to the DH in 30 minutes time. Um, I'm going to wear a sunscreen. You're supposed to wear it like 15 minutes before, but I think it'll be fine. And normally, I wouldn't wear a sunscreen. Especially now on a Sunday where my curtains are closed. I'm in my room. I know the light also does have UV rays and all of that. But on a day that I do my skincare so extensively, I just don't think I need it. But because I'm going to do, go to the DH, I'm going to just wear some. And it does make me look white, but not for long. <sighs> not for a long time. Like, it quickly goes away. And this sunscreen is from Zero Dim. It's SPF 30. I know that you can get a higher SPF, but I think for... A good SPF is 30 and above and because some of my products that I use on my face also have SPF um, so it's fine like a 30 is good enough for me 
this also lasts a really long time i bought this three months ago as well and i still have the bulk of it so for me as long as the product is affordable and also it lasts long i'm the here for it and it works i'm here for it but those products that like cost a million and they last like 30 days i don't know who their target market is but at this point in time it is not i and even when i do have the money to be buying those products sorry i'm going to be making my own because i'm not gonna give any any i'm not gonna give free money to people after all I'm, i am studying pharmacy so i might as well use the degree to make products that i do genuinely like products that i will not think are too sticky etc etc but i digress so this is like my favorite skincare product in the whole wide world when you watch my vlog you see that i recently got this thanks to my mom um so i use it for my lips because i've been really struggling with my lips like now they actually look better because i've been using it for almost a week now but i don't know actually that's kind of like tmi to be honest but they were burning and they were cracking here in the corners which might be a um sign and symptom of iron deficiency but also like the cracking that was happening whenever i'm not well my skin i can tell from my lips they crack a lot so in august i was kind of tense there i do feel better now but this has really been helping so it's the elizabeth arden sorry elizabeth arden eight hour cream so i just use this for my lips hmm. oopsie but it's literally my favorite so i got the fragrance free one and the first day i used it i was fine with it you know what like fragrance free is not always really fragrance free i mean it is fragrance free right but natural products medicinal products they also have their own scents so it might be fragrance free that it doesn't smell lovely or anything like that but it does smell to a certain extent like medicine so the first day i was okay with it when i used it at night i think my nose is extra sensitive at night and in the morning I was really bothered by it that I had to put like a Vaseline over it so I wouldn't smell it because this is like 56% petroleum jelly. And then the next day I used it and I was fine. Like now I don't really smell it as I did the first day. So it's fine. And my lips have really been healing. I also had like cold sores that were forming here in my nose and I just used it over them and now they're gone. I don't feel any pain anymore. Even on my lips, I had like cold sores forming here, but they are gone. So I really, really am for this product. I really like it so this is my skincare done you guys um thank you for watching this video i'll see you in my next video remember to subscribe if you haven't please continue sharing and liking my videos i really appreciate you guys and yeah i'll see you in my next video i wish you a great week a great productive week may the blessings of the lord be with you and may he cover you and watch over you as you go about your week bye